Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Greg here with the Wild Bradbury's bringing you update number four. So this week was a roller coaster of highs and lows. You know I got out of quarantine on Sunday afternoon and then immediately hit the ground running the next couple of days, the fire hose effect of information with on-the-job training. But bringing in the midweek, going flying, which truly makes my heart happy. As a matter of fact, I got to fly over a monument on my bucket list, which was pretty cool. Uh, I'm not checking it off my bucket list, obviously, because I didn't go there. I just flew over. But it was really neat to see the surrounding area and all of the fun hiking that will go along with it. And then when I got back from that flight, I got a package. Woo! And I've been waiting since then to open it because I, I thought it'd be fun to um, do an unboxing with you guys. It'll be much, uh, just as much of a surprise for you as it is for me. So I'll do that in just a minute. And then uh, at the time of this recording, it's Saturday. And today was just cleaning up some administrative stuff and studying, but I'm gonna go to the gym here in a little bit. Our local gym is doing a weight loss challenge. Uh, as you know, in quarantine, the food was a little bland. I've been eating quite a bit the last couple days. Been hitting the gym pretty hard and uh, I probably have a few pounds to lose. So I thought maybe this would be fun to share this journey with you you know when lydia and i decided to make this channel it was supposed to be all about traveling but because of the current situation and travel restrictions that's not exactly possible right now so i'm going to take you on this weight loss journey over the next two months with weekly weigh-ins and see what kind of progress i can make and now that i am telling the world um hopefully you guys will keep me accountable so we'll see and then tomorrow, my roommate and really good buddy is leaving town. So I'm super bummed with that. It's not a very good way to end the week. But, you know, he gets to go back and be home for a little bit. So I'm happy for him. But anyways, let's open this box. My mom has always done a really good job of wrapping packages. I don't know anybody that wraps packages better than she does. I know my wife's going to take exception to that, but I mean, look at this thing. She like wraps it in, in paper and puts tons of tape on it. As a matter of fact, I, I snipped off some tape so I could put my outline of what I wanted to talk about over there and it's taking me longer to open it. I'm sure my three-year-old could be can do better than I could. I also think it's funny when I get these packages. Uh, that are wrapped in this paper because it reminds me of, of grade school when grade school and middle school when I had to put my textbooks wrap my textbooks in paper to protect them but this is great stuff but it's like Christmas day I've been waiting I've been waiting several days to open this this is, this is the first opportunity I had and I thought it'd be fun for everybody to enjoy it with me. So every time I came back to the room, I had to stare at my box and, you know, hold off. So a little delayed gratification too, which makes it just that much better. I don't know if it's just one thing or if it's a box of things. This is uh, similar to a, a dot. Uh, so definitely, then I hear something inside. I was expecting something. I asked my mom to order me something, so I'm hoping that that's in here. Uh, just because it didn't make sense to ship it to myself. Plus she wanted to send me stuff anyways. <laughs> so the first, the first thing I got out of here, sorry about the sound, ripping, ripping paper and plastic bags and stuff. My, you know, in one of my previous videos, I told you if you send me a hat, I'll wear the hat in my videos. And my parents sent me, it was actually, actually a real nice Chiefs Super Bowl hat. And I think, I think it's kind of funny. I'm, I'm pretty excited. Well, I'm not excited because sports have been shut down, but you know, if this thing keeps going the way it's going, the Chiefs might be the only 
team to ever be uh, two-year Super Bowl champs by default because just because they can't play a season. That's a little too tight. My head is a little bit small for my body, but that was just... Hey! Hey, yeah, I kind of like this. It's pretty neat. I'm about to check that out. I like it. I like it, like it. All right, here's some other stuff. Some gum. I like gum. What flavor is this? Bubble mint gum. That's a flavor I haven't had before. Some other, some other gum. Stuff to suck on. Well, uh, so much for the weight loss challenge, huh? Oh man. Thank you, mother. I might have to uh, share these with, with all of my friends so that I don't eat the whole thing by myself. But another bag. I don't. Man, I don't know what's in here. Oh, this is probably... Okay, I'll save that for last. I'll get that in a second. She sent me two bags of coffee, which is really ironic because the coffee... Look at this. Look at this, guys. Look, look, look. I've got two and a half pounds of premium ground coffee. Now... Man, that's good stuff. It It's making for an awesome air freshener in my wardrobe but I can't brew it I want I want to enjoy my coffee today's a sad day I just got back from the gym and I was trying to make myself some coffee from the morning so I'd have some iced coffee I'd make it tonight put it in the fridge so it'd be cold in the morning and my coffee pot died look the lights on there's water in the reservoir, but it's not brewing. There's nothing coming out. I don't think it's hot anymore. It's not even hot. I think the heating element went out. Sad, sad day. So we'll have to figure something out. I, I do have an option. I think uh, one of the stores nearby, it's like an hour away though, has coffee pots. So. I'll see what my options are going there. And then this package. Yeah! All right. So this, I asked for a Sapphire 2. And you guys will be like, oh, what is that? Well, it's a, you can see on the box, a portable Wi-Fi hotspot. Uh, where I'm at, I have Wi-Fi, but no reception. Mobile, mobile reception. And I turned off my phone, so that's another reason. But what I can do is activate this and just pay for data through local cell towers so I can keep in touch with you guys a little bit better uh, just because the Wi-Fi is really spotty here but that's it I'll open this later you know to sit through that but that's it that's everything in the box got some sweets I just made a huge mess <laughs> that I have to clean up now but yeah pretty exciting man that's that's super exciting this is great stuff caramel flavored ground coffee Italian roast I'm looking forward to it. I'm just going to have to figure it out. But, all right. It is time to go to the gym and weigh in and get this thing started. So let's go do that. All right. So I made it to the gym. I'm walking inside. All right. Put my mask on. What's up, guys? Thanks. Hey, good evening. You still doing weigh-ins for the, the weigh-in challenge? The sign right here says it starts today. August 1st. Is this the RTFC? Yeah. Greg? This one? Take my shoes up. What is this? Two or four and a half. All right. 
I just left the gym. Get my pump on. Man. I knew I'd put on a couple pounds, but that number was way higher than I thought it was going to be. I feel like I'm always on a diet, though. Who's on a diet here? I'm curious. What do you guys do on a regular basis, man? I've just been hitting the gym, eating more because I'm more hungry. And the food is so much better now. But I definitely have to keep that in check. Weekly weigh-ins going forward from here. We'll see. I'm here having dinner with the boys. And I found myself being a stereotypical millennial, <laughs> getting my avocado toast. I'm missing everything but the bagel seasoning. Left that back at the shop. Rookie, Rookie mistake. Mmm. Good stuff. And a little bit gets stuck in my mustache, so I'll say something for later. <laughs> See ya. All right guys, so that's another week in the books. As you can see from the empty bed behind me, we sent the boys off this morning. Uh, we've got it, baby bird's gotta fly, you know? I uh, was kinda on the fence about putting that last clip in there with me shoveling food in my face, uh, but know yourself, see self-improvement, and you know, we will, we'll see some progress next week. If you guys help me out, keep me accountable, and that's it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So, uh, I almost forgot. Next week, Lux is coming home from his Oklahoma trip. So, I, I may not post a video. Uh, he, he took some video. So, we'll put that together and, and post that so you guys can check out his video. I'm excited to see it. I haven't seen anything yet. And pretty excited about that. So, if, um, you, know, if you want to see that video, hit that, hit that subscribe button. And then right next to it, there's a little bell. Change the notifications uh, so that YouTube tells you when we post that video. And... We'll check out his trip. Looking forward to it. Talk to you soon.